Hi Cancer, welcome to Tarot Solar Sun Studio. This is Cairo and uh, we will be reading for September 2024. This is one of the September readings. So if you are interested with some other temps, uh, you can also check out our other September readings. This one is called What No One Tells You. It is for the Cancer Collective and uh, what we're gonna find here can be anything so that's why I keep an open mind about that cancer uh, any time can come out of uh, these cards uh, and keep uh, in mind that these are general readings so they are not going to resonate or uh, actualize for everyone watching that's why please check your other astrological associations if you think those are also working for you uh, okay so what do we see here okay so I first of all the first thing that comes uh, to me is that uh, I feel here there is some kind of a company and uh, about the uh, future of, of a company or a place uh, so the future of that place, uh, which has actually strong uh, foundations uh, or known to be as uh, strong foundations, now it seems uh, have something with regards to the, uh, I mean, uh, it cannot be trusted because uh, it's a bit unknown at the moment its future. So it can be about a corporate dynamic for some of you. Uh, so for some of you, I see here some kind of a, uh, someone who is uh, choosing solitude, uh, but also uh, entertaining uh, a particular idea about something and they are not letting others know about it so this can be a subject which you would mm, normally think they will never ever get interested but it seems they are uh, I feel here like uh, there's someone and uh, this person is emotionally indifferent yes this is making them untroubled maybe but they are very much disconnected uh, as well so here this person can be uh, a, maybe a sibling some of you um, but they may take a different path they they may need to choose uh, as some kind of a different uh, way and if this is a family dynamic, maybe you do not know about it yet. I also feel here someone uh, who is like uh, overload with responsibility, want to actually unburden uh, themselves. They want ease, they want solitude. Maybe someone uh, cannot explain actually to you that they want solitude and uh, it, it, some kind of a peacefulness to maybe discover the times around their worthiness uh, and rather th than like working like so hard but rather you know working smart and uh, using a previous uh, uh, resourcefulness to maintain some kind of a uh, living uh, but what they don't tell you is maybe there is a conflict here um like having a position in authority or of authority in a place but also they want to have fewer responsibilities which do not go well i see here like there is some um, change there is going to be some change uh, in position of power at a place um and i think uh, there is there is a here a chance that someone can really say no to something but they are not choosing to do and they may not uh, 
tell you about this uh, there is a lot of stress on emotional isolation here like being emotionally cold distant uh, a person may not tell you like they don't want actually anyone to let in you know like they crave this deep loneliness and they are like finding rest in solitude like they wanna maybe withdraw from people around them including you in order to uh, look at their own emotions um, like they wanna sleep alone eat alone you know so but maybe they are like having this conflict between uh, what is really rational at the moment and what they actually also unconsciously need here uh, but I think someone here needs to clearly had it to look at their own maybe needs and fears like it can be this someone is really looking for that quiet time solitude time uh, there is a very strong emphasis, emphasis of that in the reading. Now let's check the German deck. Okay, someone's home is getting visits constantly by police maybe or like official figures like someone is being kept at home uh being like kept prison at home uh, like a long time but they are having this check they are not put in prison but they are like kept in home or there is something like a uh, uh, official declaration with regards to a home or place about its uh, uh, future uh, from now on what is going to happen to that property I also see that someone cannot uh, get close to someone maybe they have this legal decision you know decreed like someone cannot uh, um, like come closer uh, you know like more than one kilometer to you know there is this uh, type of a maybe i don't know what is called in legal terms but um that's why i feel like someone is being kept isolated and alone from others and this like goes with any type of con context cancer Uh, I see yourself more of like in a group setting here or in a place where you want to actualize your hopes and dreams and wishes uh, friend circles I see and I see like complete isolation from from there as well so in this particular dynamic There are some uh, stories hidden. Okay, now I want to get one more card from here. Wow. This card has come for a sign as well, but I don't remember which sign. This is Aries energy and it's about end of opposition. Where uh, a depression is over. Uh, where but that used to be a depression it's over the opposition is over and negotiation is like found but now like uh, people will commit to that uh, decision from now on like there is some kind of a peace now at a place one is not gonna come and distract others peace or uh, not gonna get involved so something in that nature cancer 
so thank you so much cancer for listening uh, i hope uh, that helps uh, so as i mentioned there are other readings in the channel uh, that you may be uh, find relevant maybe with regards to what you go through now i also recommend you to check uh, those as well <clears throat> you can uh, check the playlist tab or the video section also sometimes click on the live tab uh, in the channel uh, screen because uh, that, that we also sometimes do live readings as well so uh, thank you so much take care cancer bye bye